How's it going guys? MC of Got Milk here and welcome back to another auto video. Oh, it's been a long time since I said those words. Real quick, I know I like to get my videos straight to the point and you guys are here to watch this, but it's been a while. I took a break of YouTube. I'm back. That's all I have to say. But I found this nifty trick for anybody who has a Ford F-150, Ford Explorer, anything that has a digital gauge on their Fords. So the digital odometer. So if I click this here. Boom, oh, nope, the key's not in, but point is, this is where the odometer will show, and I'll show that in a second. Put the key in, turn it. As you can see, this is the odometer. So this applies to every Ford vehicle that has a screen. For example, has a screen that is from 2005 to modern day now, so like a two, from 2020. And I'll tell you guys what it does and what the hack is. Before I bore all you guys that probably already know what this is and you guys are just wanting me to tell you guys already, it's called Ford Engineer Mode and it gives you a whole bunch of more details for your truck. So I'll tell you how to get to do that right now. You gotta do two simple things. One, you gotta hold this button down while the truck is off and while the truck is off, you gotta turn the ignition and then as you'll see on the screen right here, it'll say Ford Engineer Mode and I'll do that for you at this exact time. Bear with me because I did lose my uh, little tripod thing. You see me back here. So I'm going to do what I said. I'm going to push the button in. You can hear it. Now I'm going to see the odometer pop up. Now I'm going to turn the key. Engineering mode, task mode, and then this is just one of the things, which gauge test. And again, like as it's in engineer mode, you can still turn the truck fully on. It does not mess with the truck. So, as we go, we'll cycle through. You got to see uh, the screens all good. Shows all of the lights. And there's a lot of other stuff, there's a lot of useless stuff you can do with this. As you can see, there's a bunch of manufacturing stuff and a bunch of codes. But you can also do your digital speedometer here. So I'm gonna click. There's that. So you have a digital speedometer for all you guys that want one of those, you guys want to go to the racetrack in your Ford. If you click it again, you got it in kilometers. So if you're in a different country, for example, I'm in the United States, so if I want to go to Canada, which I want to do, and you take your truck or your car, you can then do the speed limit. But then if you keep going through, you got tachometers and then everything, fuel level inputs, a lot of useless stuff and a lot of useful stuff. So again, if you guys see coolant temperature, there's everything you can do with this. And then again, see so you had your battery voltage there. We'll go slower. Keep going. I think it goes to 10. I'm trying to reset it for you guys. There you go. Once it gets back to gauge test, after it checks all that, see, truck's still on. It's still doing everything fine. And it goes right back. To get rid of this, to get out of this, all you do, truck off. As you can see, and it's back to normal with trip A, trip B, miles to empty, average fuel mileage, which is garbage, and the system checks. All right, guys, I hope this was simple, sweet, and to the point, and if you guys need any of that stuff, or if you guys just want to have a cool little uh, trick with uh, digital speedometers, tachometers, all stuff, I know the older trucks, sometimes some of them don't have uh, the tacks. So, just a little nice little nifty thing for you guys to do. Oh yeah, before I leave, this is how you do it on a 2009. I told you I'd do, show you guys how to do it on a, uh, newer versions. So let's say you, this is a, this is a 2009, like I said. Let's say this is a 2000 and a 2019. You're gonna have the buttons here, right? So you should have a up, left, right, down, should be an okay button. If you hold down the OK button and then you turn the key or the push start whatever, that's how you get to that exact thing with the newer trucks. So all you do is you push that OK down and you turn the ignition. Thank you, Mr. Tow Truck. Push the OK, turn the ignition, and you should be in your test mode or your engineer mode. But all right, guys, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It's great to be back. I love all you guys. I love what I do, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.